where we have run the soil warrior, we have harvested the best corn we have ever harvested in the history of Renwood Farms. So we're in a continuous no-till environment. We're 30 inch row corn. We plant seven and a half inch row beans and we also plant seven and a half inch row small grain. We've been in that routine for decades and we've seen benefit to it. Now, I'm kind of always wanting to push the envelope to see what else I can do to help enhance that emergence. Well, in the last two years, we've kind of decided to try another route. So we've been introduced into the soil warrior. We're tilling only about a seven inch band of air soil, still leaving the rest of it on our 30 inch rows in a no-till environment. The things that we're seeing, our ride is so much smoother, our seed placement is even better. Here, I thought we were doing a good job before, but we've even enhanced that and we're getting that uniform emergence. Compared to our no-till environment, when we're planting across those strips and we get a rain event, it dries out quicker. And then we also notice the soil's not sticking to the closing wheel, the gauge wheels, nearly as bad in the stripped environment compared to the no-till. Everything has been simplified. There's not a whole lot of daily maintenance to it. The Soil Warrior, we're able to do two things at one time. We're getting the soil prepared and adding and impregnate a little bit of fertilizer at the same time. Where we had our best emergence and we've had our best yields was where we ran the Soil Warrior. And you know, I see it being a part of our operation in years to come.